Hi guys, RC back with the Go 3D bodies. We finally got all the resin figured out. Um, we got these nice bodies. We got a nice flexible strength to them. Um, they are not indestructible. They are two gram pieces of plastic that are light and flexible. I don't ever expect anything that's, you know, under two grams of plastic to be indestructible. Even injection molded bodies that are that light. Um, they can be stronger, but they're not indestructible by any means. Um, I've done some video testing that I've uploaded the channel before of me smashing into a tech block with this exact same mixture. We've just got our colors figured out, and for right now we've got a blue, yellow, a burnt orange, a green, a purple, and a, a candy orange, a bubblegum pink, smoke white, and our sun-kissed orange. Um, the bodies have, if you watch the other videos, you would see the support points much more clearly. In these, you can barely see them. That's just, uh, you know, a perfectionist understanding his craft and, you know, minimizing, uh, the amount that we see off the model. Uh, I would still, you can, so I said these are, see, they're 2 to 2.1 grams, most of them. Um, a lot of the weight dependence discrepancy depends on if, you know, where the support breaks off. You know, if you get a bunch of them that break off a little long, that adds a little weight. Um, if you want to lose some weight, I had to end up thickening up here a little bit. You can see there's a square in here. Uh, you can actually trim that down. Um, that was just to help the model come off the supports better without warpage. Um, we also added these two strengthening flares here for impact um, I would not touch those for lightning um, what I would do to lighten the body some more myself is sometimes there's still some points on the post you can need to take a file or the flattening tool and use and just you know flatten that post down um, there's very few of them on the back uh, I would, before I say the rest of the weight that I would take off myself is I'd go after this post, this post, the posts. Um, but you need to, you want to drill and tap them, drill them with an 059 for a tighter fit, 063 for a looser fit screw. I, I would drill and tap them first and then go after them. Um, these bodies, it, so with a 3D printed body, it's printed in micro layers um, with a UV light the micro layers so for instance a cast body the polymers inside the resins when they pour them you know they they all intermix because it turns into one solid piece basically these are tiny little micro layers so if you would say break a uh, cast body they will a lot of times crack these usually shatter if they do break um, so, I mean, you know, when you break one, you normally get pieces. Just bad. Um, but, for the most part, I don't think we'll have issues breaking them uh, any more so than you would a cast body. Um, you know, it is the first mainstream body of its choice. We've got the wing all under control. We used to have some flaring going on there. we got really nice detail uh, for the painters. You know, headlights, taillights, vents. Um, we also have a, sorry, I'm a squeaky chair, a painted body that we just painted with a metallic black, you know, two coats, and then we, I think we did a matte, uh, clear coat on it. That's, you know, we got some other stuff that we've been playing with, with a shiny coat. Uh, it looks a little bit wet, which, you know, it's kind of neat. Real shiny, um, and they paint. But when you paint them, they most of the lineage goes away that you could see. You know, they're still very. And this isn't wasn't sanded or anything. This was just popped in an airbrush and sprayed. Um, so that's what we have. Um, they should be up very shortly on the website, and I hope you enjoy them. Um, and a beard here. My apologies for that. Um, and the colors look really nice. Um, we have some more. We can do more of this stuff. Not sure how popular this stuff will be. Just kind of experimentation. But we can do more of the 
opaque stuff and possibly some more colors. The Trans Am is coming very shortly as well. Uh, so we hope you enjoy them. All bodies will be come with two screws and a windshield uh, of $15. And um, uh, please just let me know your feedback. Uh, message me on Facebook or on here. If you buy one, you like it, dislike it, you know. Just honest feedback is always good so we can improve the product. Uh, it, it's a new product, so we want to improve it if we can. So thanks for listening, and I'll talk to you soon.